Good morning, you guys. I'm here with the porter and Grayson and Berkeley. We are watching. It's Berkeley Sa. We are watching Berkeley for my parents. They're going out of town just for the night, so we're watching her. Yeah, she does stay at Grams and Gramps' house, huh? But we're gonna watch her for today. She's like, I wanna go outside, hurry up. We are just hanging out. Um, we are, still have the lights low because our AC still doesn't work, so an update on that. We had the company come out for a second time the next day, and our AC uh, part was still frozen over. And so there was nothing that they could do. And so they left again and so we still have no AC. We are hoping that they're gonna come back today. There's really no communication from them on what the plan is, so I might have to call them again to figure out what's going on. I don't ever wanna use this company again. We're, the only reason we're using them is because they're the company we got this um, unit from. So that's why we're using them. I have not been impressed with our customer service. So anyway. We are without AC still. So last night, uh, thankfully we have an attic fan in our house, which if you don't know what that is, Google it. But basically it's like this huge fan in the ceiling upstairs and it just pulls, sucks in all the um, air from outside and down in the basement. So last night it got down to like 60s or 50s. So we had all the windows open on the main floor and we just ran the attic fan all night. And so it's like pretty cool in here at 69. So we're shutting all the windows because it's 69 outside, so we don't want it to get any hotter in here. And we're gonna just like keep the lights low, try not to use like, as many electronics as we can, and just keep it cold in here as long as we can. It's supposed to get up to like 81, 84 today. So today's not too bad, but starting tomorrow, it's supposed to get up to like 88 and 90s. So I'm really nervous that if they don't come today and if they don't fix it today, then we're gonna be in big trouble. So anyway, that's what's going on with that. And other news, I turned on the TV, which I don't usually turn on TVs around just because I don't see the need to, other unless we're watching like a show or I'm watching one of my shows. But the Olympics is on today. So we are watching, this is Mexico. We're watching the Olympics. This is actually live. It's in Japan this year. I'm sure you all know that. Japan is, 13 hours ahead of us, so even though it's like 9 a.m. here, it's 10 p.m. there, but they're showing the ceremony live, so I just put it on just to show Gray, and I was telling Gray about the Olympics, and so every time a new country comes on, he's always like, what's that, what's that, what's that, what's that? So I've been telling him all the country names that come through, so it's just kind of fun to show him the Olympics. Yeah, I don't think he'll really remember it, but it's always something interesting, something different, so. We have that on just to see the different countries and learn a little bit about geography, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. But anyway, yes, the Olympics. I always enjoy watching the Olympics. Some of it's boring. Some of it's exciting. So I'm sure we'll watch it here and there. But it's it'll be hard because Japan is like on a way different time zone than us. But anyway, he's watching the Olympics. Well, not really, but kind of. And I am cleaning while holding Porter at the same time. So I'm not getting much cleaning done. Also this morning we had a interesting time. I was cleaning and Porter was in the bathroom, which he likes to play with the door stopper on the back of the door in there. So I was like, fine, whatever, he's gonna play with that. But then I heard a splashing sound and I came onto this. So I'll input the Snapchat video here. Porter Hudson, what are you doing? No. Play in the toilet water. Oh my gosh. We don't play in the toilet paper. We don't play in the toilet porter. Ew. That's yucky. That is yucky. Porter. Yes, Porter was playing in the water. So that was great. So then I got Porter away and I got back to cleaning and then all of a sudden I find Grayson in the bathroom and he has taken his baby doll and he has submerged it in the toilet. So I'll put that video here. Grayson, no! Uh. 
So yeah, that's what I've been dealing with today. So we're trying to uh, dry out Grayson's baby doll. And she's full of toilet water. Thankfully, it's clean toilet water, but it's still toilet water, it's still gross. So that's what we've been dealing with this morning. What do you think, boys? Hi. Can you say hi? He is in desperate need of a haircut. I really want to cut it. I'm trying to hold off until next week to do it. And Gray singing. This is so comical. Gray is running and he's making Berkeley run with him and he gets so mad every time she stops to sniff something, which is like everything. And <laughs> I've just got Porter here in the stroller. We're just following them. Say, come on, Berkeley. There she goes. Gray is living his best life. It's so cute. Oh, this, oh gosh, oh, oh. This really makes me want to have a dog. He's so happy. Oh man, these kids. What are you doing, Gray? Gray is smelling the flowers. They're all dead flowers. He's smelling the flowers. Berkeley's taking a break because we're wearing her out. Good morning, you guys. It's the next day. We ended up going on three different walks yesterday, and so Berkeley is like pooped. She went, we came back from the third walk at like seven o'clock last night, and she went up to her bed and did not come down until like 11 to get pets, and then she went right back to bed. She was so tired. But we're having a really good morning walk. Gray loves walking Berkeley and um, it's fun to have a dog here just for a day. I wanted to update you guys on the whole AC situation. We finally, finally got it figured out. And honestly, I feel so dumb. It took the AC people coming three different times to our house because something was frozen over. And so they had to wait two days for it to finally unfreeze. And we had all these problems. The AC wasn't working. All of this just to find out that the AC wasn't working because we didn't change our filter often enough. So I feel really dumb because we paid like so much money just to find out that we needed to replace our filter, which is like common knowledge. But in our defense, the filter that we got from the store on the packaging, it said switch every 12 months. And I switched it in the winter. So it had not been 12 months yet. So we thought we were okay. But the AC people who came and looked at it said, no, you need to be switching it every six months because of how dusty our house is or whatever. And so basically the filter is dirty, then the air can't flow through. And so then it gets backed up and that's what causes it to like freeze over. We figured it out. I feel silly, but now we know. So PSA, if you haven't checked your filter in a while at your, for your AC, go check it because that was our problem. So now our AC is working, which thank goodness, because starting today, it's gonna be high 80s and it's gonna be high 80s, low 90s until Thursday and it's Saturday. So almost a week of really, really hot weather. So it's gonna be very, very hot. So we're just trying to stay cool, but I'm so glad our AC is fixed. Gray, should we keep walking? Yeah. No. Berkeley's tired. <laughs> let me fix your shoes. Okay, let me fix your shoes. We ended up watching the Olympic ceremony last night and it was really good, but it was kind of boring. It was super long. It was from 7.30 to midnight. That's like four and a half hours. Are you laying down? Gray, let's get up. Should we go back to the house? No. Okay, well, let's walk then. Who's that? Oh, got dirt everywhere. Come on, let's keep walking. Oh my goodness. Are you laying down? Are you laying down? Mm -hmm. So yeah, we were watching some Olympic soccer this morning and some beach volleyball. So I'm excited just to watch some different Olympic sports and see what there is to see. Gray. You're supposed to get up. Yep, get up. Come on, let's keep walking. <laughs> 